Welcome everybody to game week 7. The last couple of weeks haven't hit the expectations that I set out. So this week is the wild card. The wild card is active. And as you can see, several changes have been made to the team to improve the squad. And we've gone with players that are in form and that have decent fixtures in upcoming. Ariola has come in for Ramsdale who doesn't play. Ariola is a great stop, stop shopper, stopper. And a few decent fixtures apart from Newcastle, but for 4.2 million, he comes in. Turner is kept. As he do, they also do have a few decent fixtures coming up as well. So we've got two decent keepers for under 4.5 million, which is great. Bell stays the same as is a double game week for Luton. He stays in for 4 million as well. It's, it's a bargain. Boatman and Byrne, both. 75% fit chance of playing. We think they're going to be fit. The rumours are they'll both be fine. And fixtures coming up really, really good. Especially the last time we had the 8-0 victory over Sheffield United. Plenty of clean sheets, I believe, coming up. And definitely some goals. So both of them come in. And for 4.5 and 4.7 million, it's a great addition to the team. Gabriel comes in. And Saliba comes out just to free up a, bit, a few more funds there. So we've had to put Gabriel in to free up some funds. And Evans could be a bit hit and miss this one, not sure. Um, obviously played last week. Got a goal and a clean sheet. I think he might play now. But again, a bit of hit and miss. Four million, no, you can't go wrong. May United defender in there. Saka. Should be fit as well. Again, rumours he's got a knock, but rumours suggest that he'll be fine. So I'm going to keep with him in there. Salah definitely comes in there. Hitting really good form there. And I think with the scores of the last three weeks and the fixes that he's got coming up, there's definitely more goals there. And I think he's now a must-have in the team. Son, again, last week, fantastic two goals. And in a few weeks before that hat-trick, he has to stay in now. Um, I think he could be the main man for Spurs. And they've got some decent fixtures coming up as well, with Luton away in there. Wall Prowse, it was a, a, it was between him and Bowen. I couldn't get Bowen in to Wall Prowse. He's got an assist in him all the time. Um, p penalties, free kicks, corners. There's just He's got a lot of things about him. 6.3 million, it's a great addition. So he comes in with Sheffield United next. We've shipped in eight goals. Surely there's something there for him. And Gordon, now with Harvey Barnes out for a while, we think Gordon's going to get a good, good run now. And he's got a goal in him as well. And decent fixtures coming up for Newcastle too. 5.6 million is a steal. Morris comes in as a cheap striker. Has got a goal in him as well. Scored a couple of penalties, double game week as well. He comes in and hopefully he'll do us proud. Watkins comes back in after me taking him out last week, which was a silly move, I know. But he comes back in, Aston Villa fixtures are very good. Just be wary of them being in Europe as well at the same time. But decent fixtures coming up for Watkins. We think he's going to hit some form now. And then obviously, early in Haaland. You've got to have him in, no matter who he's playing against. So, we go back to picking our team. This is the team, and this is who we've gone with. Harlan captain, Morris vice captain. We've kept in Boatman, Byrne and Saka. We think they're going to overcome their illness or, or fitness or injuries. And they'll be absolutely fine. So, that is it. Wild card active.